You're watching the COP TV, the voice of football's most famous stand. Salah to settle it! In front of the COP! Right, AGT with Tammy here. 2-1 uh, win. I mean, it wasn't really a game that got us off our seats too many times during the 90 minutes, but like I've said in all the other fan cams, we did what we needed to do just. Yeah, I mean, it wasn't one of those games we were expecting to be, like winning 3 4 0. But we should have done a lot better than we did today. But it's quite clear that we're missing some key players. And I think Curtis Jones got a bit of a knock in the end there, which could be yeah. concerning. Um, but yeah, got the job done. There's still another 90 minutes to go, obviously. So it's all down to the next leg, really. Yeah, and listen, again, respect to Fulham for setting up the way they did. They got their goal. They they didn't do much apart from that, if I'm totally honest. But they, they were still leading for 70 team. minutes. They were lucky, I'll give you that. Yeah, they got quite lucky with their goal. I mean, the set, first half we were awful. Like uh, There was really nothing to be cheering and shouting about in the first half. But the second half was definitely an improvement of seeing Nunes come on. Um, Gakpo as well. Um, but yeah, it's, it's one of those games where it's midweek, we're tired, we've had some big games recently, again. so um, it's on to the next one as well. Yeah, 100%. Listen, two minutes, two goals kind of kind of seized the game off. And like you said, we go into that second round. Rory's mentioning the quad, you know what he's like, it's his favourite <laughs> bloody word. Um, <laughs> how close are we to maybe adding another trophy to that cabinet? I mean, it's a semi-final, in it? So we are one step away now. <laughs> getting closer. I'm hoping we're going to Wembley. I want to be there, so hurry up and get us to Wembley, boys. Um, but I think it's definitely within reach 2-1 going into the next leg. Hopefully, Craven Cottage is going to be hard to play at, so yeah. I mean, we'll see how Arsenal it goes, but there. exactly, that's the tough one. At home, their crowd can really put in a shift like we can here, and I think it wasn't the greatest atmosphere today, but it is what it is midweek. Yeah, good contributions as well from Gakpo and Nunez when they came on. Um, man of the match tonight? Curtis Jones. Curtis Jones. I was, at half time I was thinking it was either Ibu or Curtis, but Curtis obviously scoring a brilliant goal in the second half, made the difference and put us forward, got the crowd behind him, changed the game. Not much, but enough that we could win. So it's happy days on to the next. On to the next. Listen, no game now for 12 days odd. Happy days. So, uh, well, we 11 tired. days. Yeah, listen, I think the fans need a break as well. This has we been do. a pretty intense <laughs> few weeks over Christmas. So, um, again, Tammy says, Curtis Jones, man of the match. Let us know in the comments who you thought it was. Tammy, all the best. Happy New Year. And we'll see you on the next one. Thanks for watching this video, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Please, guys, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe to the Cop TV. The voice of, of football's, football's most, most famous, famous stand. stand.